when you speak of London, it was obviously a disappointing moment for you and for the entire team. Uh, that semi-final day against Germany, do you think that the team was outplayed, or was it more a case of us not playing to our potential? Oh, uh, well, what does it mean? I mean, I think we we played some bad moments in the game, and the things, some of the things where we were vulnerable, got exposed. That's that's what happened. Um, but you know. Um, and you know, we, the, you go into the tournament thinking that, thinking that you've got, you've always got vulnerable aspects of your team, and and that day we got exposed. We didn't play to our potential, no. And uh, there were a range of factors. I think mentally the occasion was a part of it. I think the heat was a part of it. I think the whole program, the fact that we had early mornings, late, early. That, that made it difficult, um, and then on that day, uh, you know, our opponents took their chances, and we didn't. You know, so there was a whole range of things. But you look at the got score in the end, we didn't get outplayed. I, I can't remember us being outplayed very often at all in the time I've been there. I think there's been times when we've been matched by other teams, but not that often outplayed. What about our coach? Hmm? Well, I don't understand people talk about the team being coached or whatever. Um, and, you know, in the AFL they talk about, oh, he coached badly today. I mean, most of the decisions and judgments that are made on the field are made by players, not by the coaches. Maybe we didn't prepare well enough. There were things we didn't do. Did we not select the best team? We, did we, there may be things we could have done there. Or, or you'll always look back on that. But, for instance, on the corner defence, we knew what we had to do, but we didn't do it. Was that the coach's fault or the players? I don't know. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Are you confident that you picked the right team? Yeah, I really... It was terrible. I was terribly disappointed to have to um, lose um, Dez along the way. I think that hurt us a little bit. But it only hurt us if Dez had been fully fit and Dez wasn't. I didn't think he was up to it. And uh, in the end... We played the semi-final with a striker um, with a problem that day anyway. If we had another one going into the tournament that way, I think that would have been a mistake. So that that hurt us. Germany got their best players on the field for that Olympics and we probably didn't. We lost Rob along the way too. So you take out Rob and Dez. Um, and, you know, I think that... Um, you know, our goalkeeper had a bad day that day too, and that can hurt you as much as anything, you know, so there's, and, you know, that's, that's, that was a, the biggest selection issue was that one in my view, and we, you know, maybe we didn't get that right. You talk about uh, that game against Germany, we often, we often had pretty good battles with Germany, and you've shared correspondence with Marcus Weiss over the years about different things. Was he the toughest coach you had to coach against? Well, I just think Germany had the best team we played against, you know? All things considered, you know, their hardness, their, their rigidity, their discipline, I think they were the things, you know? I'm not sure that they, 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 had, they had good players, but I don't think they had any special, anything special. I think they had good goalkeeping, solid defenders, tough defenders, real discipline couple of good midfielders and some danger at the front, so then they had the full team, you know, and we had tough games and clearly they were the toughest team we played against. And uh, Marcus is a coach that I greatly respect. He made the comment to me after the Olympics that, you know, sometimes those sorts of happenings like our performance there are the things that catalyse you to do better and I think we addressed a lot of the issues that we noticed in London, and I think we did a pretty good job of fixing some of those things. Every team has, uh, in, in the world, has some brilliant players, you know. A guy like Jackson can always hurt you because he's capable of uh, the unusual, the special. Christopher Zeller, I think, I saw in the same way. 